All right, hey friends, we are getting to the segment of um, part two of our day here. Today uh, now is prep for our Mexican barbecue tamale party for Father's Day slash Justin's birthday, which is tomorrow. So food prep, I'm gonna wash some dishes real quick from our breakfast slash dinner last night. My birthday's not tomorrow. I know his birthday's not tomorrow. His birthday's Monday, but tomorrow's the party day with the family. He's gonna start on the broccoli salad. I'm gonna wash dishes. We're gonna get some bacon cooked and all the other things that need to get done today, so. All right, our first time ever, we are using our giant bowl that I got for Christmas this year. And that's just to make it easier to mix up this broccoli salad, so. Eating the sunflower seeds, I see. My favorite part. <laughs> So, I already made the dressing, so he's going to get it all mixed up. We need the bacon. Oh, I need the bacon. Alright, we're going to add, we added the bacon, now he's adding the sauce. Oh, we need some, well, there's peppered bacon in there, so. Yeah, there's peppered bacon, so. So why'd you guys decide to use the big bowl? To the mix dressing. it, because it, the broccoli filled up that smaller bowl, like, all the oh, way to the top. So there was not going to be room for mixing, but this way there's room for mixing and then we probably could stick it back in that bowl or we could use some, a couple of the tin foil pans and just put it in a couple of tin foil pans so it will be easier to transport when we want to wash any dishes when it's done. Did you yeah. just flick it out on top of yourself? Like what just happened? Being fancy. Uh, yeah, very fancy. Fancy mixing. First thing you do, just take a gallon of tea. And you get rid of about 800 milliliters. There. Why does it look like there's more liquid in that vodka bottle? Don't you think? I thought how we did it before was we just dumped out a bunch and then poured the vodka in and then just poured whatever tea back in that needed to fill it up. That's a taste under. And then bring it over here when I want to taste it too. So that's the tea regular. Mm. Oh, that's really good. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's now good. bring me back over here. That's the diet uh, tea lemonade. But like you said, we'll dump out a little bit more. Because you don't want to have to dump it out after the vodka's yeah, already Yeah, you don't want to mix it all. So you just want a, a pure mix. Yeah. So then you take the verka. Verka. Verka, verka, verka. She's very deceiving. The verka, verka, I'm Swedish chef. <laughs> the drunk Swedish chef. And you put the verka in. Basically 715 milliliters, so. Nice. Hunter, shaky shaky. Eggs and bakey. Alright, let's see if it tastes any different. It should, right? Right. A little, oh, cup. A little cup, please. Doesn't even smell different. That's how it gets That's it. the beauty of it. Even better because now it's not as sweet. <laughs> the leftovers. You drink it all? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I drink it all. It was this much in a cup. <laughs> all right, Hunter has made our cupcakes for our celebration. We have red velvet and we have a carrot cake. I am getting ready to put together my, what is it called? Mexican street corn potato salad. So I have my potatoes seasoned and there's my poblano peppers roasted and I have some red onion in there. So I'm gonna go ahead and add the other ingredients. So now I've added the roasted corn, 
This is just the Costco um, roasted uh, Mexican street corn frozen corn bag. So I just cooked one of those up or a couple of them up and threw that in there. All right, then I'm adding some bacon and green onion. Now I will add the dressing, which is mayonnaise and sour cream. All right, and the final touch after I stirred in the mayonnaise and sour cream, I'm going to add a little bit of this uh, Cotija crumbly cheese. And that will just add a little cheesiness to it. There we go. And then we have uh, our finished Mexican street corn uh, potato salad. I got my salad all mixed up here, except for I forgot one thing, the juice of a couple of limes. So I'm going to throw that juice in there and then it will be complete. But we tasted it already and it is my new favorite potato salad. Pretty much just a recipe I kind of just winged together. Uh, after we thought about what we were going to make for a potato salad, I looked up a recipe. And it was pretty much how I would have made it anyway, so I just kind of threw a bunch of stuff that I thought would go good. Um, how I would normally make my Mexican street corn salad plus potato salad and so forgot the lime juice let's do that right now dropping a load off at the in-laws house I'm not sure what is happening here but this is crazy and he's crazy <laughs> yes <yeah>, so am I <laughs> okay. first batch of masa is made let's see what's going on Whipping the lard right now, and then this is the masa and broth are soaking while the lard is being whipped, and then we'll mix that together. And that will be ready for tamales. Good afternoon. It is Father's Day, so happy Father's Day, my love. Thank you. And uh, we are headed off to the in-laws house. We've got to make a couple of stops real quick, but we got everything loaded up. And uh, all the food we're bringing, the potato salad, the broccoli salad, our um, adult beverages, all those sorts of things. So off we go. It's a sprinkly, sprinkly cloudy day, but it's actually not too cold, so that's kind of nice. We are here. All right, I'm going to go unload some stuff. This place is smelling so good right now. Oh my gosh. Masa is ready, it's getting warmed up. And he's got the meat just about ready, so we are gonna sit down and start making some tamales. We're going to hang out. Right. Yeah. All y'all the stuff oh, on I there. Have not reached it. Oh, <laughs> I didn't notice. How do you get what out? The saucy sauce. Mm -hmm. oh. Batteries. Batteries. Mm -hmm. it's, it's a book. It's a book. Maybe it's, it's a piece of cardboard. It's a picture frame. Maybe it's a box. It's, it's uh, underwear. Maybe it's a piece of pizza. Uh, <laughs> I knew it. Yeah, I knew it. I knew what it was. That was close. I knew it. It was the shirts. All right, we are loaded up and ready to go. That was a successful evening. <laughs> that was a successful evening uh, day of making tamales and eating the tamales. It was delicious. So, thank you so much for watching. <laughs> I really appreciate it. We'll see you all in the next video. Bye.